Hello, folks, and welcome back to the Gnostic Reclamation from Polarization Nation Media. As always, I'm Jason James Bickford. There's an Etsy store for Gnostic Reclamation, in case you were unaware. I've had about 18 sales over here so far, and I haven't had anything posted on this page for quite some time. So I just uploaded some 8x10 Gnostic Surreal art panels. These start off as digital pieces. I build Surreal Collage. Then I have them printed up on these wood panels in a studio in California. They're all eco-friendly, using solar power. That's nice. Anyway, we got Sophia in the Exile, Wonderment, and Sophia of September, my favorite new piece. This piece, Wonderment, was available on 5x7 prints before. Uh, constructed the same way. You can lean those on a shelf with the wood, wood tab there and prop them up. And there's also hanging hardware and notches in the back for you to... Uh, just hang it up flat on the wall and it, it's kind of pushed up above the wall because of the notch that's cut out so it kind of looks like it's floating there it looks nice anyway i do both i lean them on shelves i also hang them up on the wall a very important person in my life told me a few years ago she was noticing that the visual art i was showing her predated my videos by one two years sometimes and there was esoteric information embedded in my gnostic artwork that I didn't articulate uh, verbally as a concept until much later in my videos. Meaning, very often you see the lightning first and then you hear the thunder. My visual art seems to be the most predictive thing I produce. I'm not gonna explicitly say what that means as far as each one of these pieces of artwork. In fact, it might be uh, with these newer pieces of art, I can't completely articulately explain what the co-creative faculty that creates this artwork with me is actually saying. So I'm a messenger, but I'm also a vehicle for my co-creative faculty. I died in 2008 and came back with a light passenger that shows me things and we work together. That's the Holy Spirit. So. I'm going to do the best I can to articulate the visual information I'm getting, as well as the um, concepts that I speak of in my decoding videos. I'm going to do my best to keep regular art prints up on the Etsy page. Uh, the more you buy, the more I'll post. Please don't uh, be shy. If you're looking for a particular image you've seen, or if there's something I had up on the store that sold out, uh, let me know. You can click on my um, previous sales on that Etsy page to see the type of material I've sold in the past. I'll be happy to reproduce any of these prints, uh, hand stain them and get them ready. That really only uh, takes a little bit of time out of my afternoon. The artwork is about 80 to 90% finished on the iPad. So when I get these prints back from the print shop, I've got one, two hours of work to do on them a piece until I get them into shape to finish them off and then I sign them. So each print is a unique, one-of-a-kind piece of work. I'm finishing the artwork. So essentially, I could make 20 versions of this piece right here, but since it's only about 80 to 90% done on wood panel, the finishing details and touches are things that I have to do myself. As you can see here, and I've got these beautiful Swiss watercolor pencils that just melt like creamy paint on these wood panels. So uh, yeah, buy my art and support the cause. Thanks, guys. Links in the comments.